Hey, this is Ask the Boot Guy, where you guys get to ask me questions about work boots, work gear, personal questions, whatever you choose. Today's question comes from a guy named Tyler Cassidy. He sent me an email asking me a historical question. When did boot companies start putting collars on work boots, and are they better than work boots without them? First part is a historical question. When did it start? I really can't answer that because my historical boot knowledge isn't like somebody who studies a world war or you know ancient cultures or something like that i can tell you this though there are a lot of these vintage clothing stores in chicago that i go to primarily i'm trying to see how older boots were made and they are and they are a really good resource for me to see some boots from the 70s and the 60s when work boots were very basic and very plain not built for comfort not built for anything more than protection. It isn't until I started to see boots with a sole material called a marathon sole or more of a cork sole, when they started mixing soles and leathers like this with still hard plastic welts and leather welts that I start to see collars coming on those boots. Now that's gotta be sometime in the 60s. Maybe in the early 70s, you start seeing more boots with a soft padded leather collar. Now, are they more comfortable? Yeah. Now, are they better? That's a personal question. That's a personal choice. I personally don't mind a boot one way or the other. It all depends on the type of leather and the type of boot it is. Now, if I had to work in that type of boot all day long, I would probably want a padded collar. If I had to have something with a very hard sole with a steel shank, I would definitely want a padded collar. Now, remember, we're talking about six inch boots here. There are a lot of eight inch boots that come with padded collars, but primarily you'll find it in the six inch variety. So I hope this kind of answers your question, Tyler. I know you wanted something that was more of a historical answer, like a pinpointing date that said, you know, in 1892, the SSB company decided that they were going to put a collar on their one time classic heritage boot. I can't give an answer like that because I really don't know. So this is Ask the Boot Guy, where you guys get to ask me questions about footwear, workwear, boots all kinds of stuff whatever you choose hey remember you can follow me on instagram and twitter check out my new facebook page and if you're inclined please think about supporting me on patreon it really helps if you guys give me some support some financial backing in order to keep this thing going and in order to keep it fresh and exciting all right i'll see you soon